Hello, Berkshire Hathaway Home Services sales executives for our video message of the week. All right, we are still on this theme of how do we ensure 2018 is your best year ever? All right, today we're gonna to talk about this concept of priorities. And I really believe that there's a confusion in what's a priority and what's just stuff that needs to get done. In fact, specifically, what gets blended in with priorities and it shouldn't is, well, your to-do list. I'm not saying they're not important items, but it's just things that have to get done on an ongoing basis. Sometimes we think of those as their priorities and they're really not. Secondly is the whirlwind. Listen, life happens, there's stuff hitting you at all times, but we blend some of that whirlwind stuff that it's a priority and it's not. Let me help you out here. Priorities are a must complete. Priorities are so important that you can ask yourself or tell yourself that if I accomplish everything else, but I don't get done these priorities, I'm in trouble. I'm not happy. This is not a good thing. And if you look at a to-do list or you look at kind of the whirlwind stuff, if you're honest with yourself, you'll say, well, I want to get this done, but if it doesn't happen, it's not a tragedy. Um, even if it's a challenge with a client or whatever, you'll jump into it and at that moment in time, I know it feels like it's an absolute priority. And it may be at that moment in time, but the reality of it is, if that one item doesn't get done, it doesn't change your world. What priorities truly are is the must achieve. Let me give you an example. Let's say you've got this list of things to do and you've got your income over here. Well, guess what? If you, let's say, complete this entire list, you were amazing, you got this entire list done, but your income drops in half, are you gonna be okay with that? I will say 99.999% of the time, all of you are saying no. So in that example, what's truly the priority is, guess what? I want my income to be here. I want my income to be here, and by the way, these are to-do lists that I really would like to get done. But number one, this is my priority. Now, the other piece of a priority, a priority should always have a timeline. Always have a timeline. My opinion is everything you wanna get done should have a timeline, but a priority is key. Because as soon as that priority is completed, guess what? Another priority can move in to take its place. Basically what I'm saying is, is truly, you only have one priority that you're working on at any one time. Now. One caveat, there could be that overlying priority. Like I said, hitting your income for the year, for 2018. That's the main priority, that's the overlying priority. And now it's the activities that you're gonna do to make sure you hit that one priority. And let's be clear, that's a priority. Now, keep in mind, priorities don't only have to be dollars, okay? They could be, let's say, you know what, one of your priorities is hiring a new exceptional administrative assistant. And it's a priority to get the right person, not just hire someone, but get the right person. And I want that person hired by the end of February. Okay, you've got your timeline, you've got what you need to do, and now you can build. This is the job description for this person, this is my expectations. All that stuff blends into that one priority. And guys, that truly is a priority. What today's message is all about is this. Look, I know you're hit with a million things all the time, but you may feel there's no additional time to get anything else done, and I will push back. That's not a correct statement. What I want you to really investigate is, wait a minute, these are things that I would like to get done that in many ways are important to get done, but they're not my number one priority. Here's my number one priority, and here's a secondary that I know is a priority over everything else. Let's say you had those two. Priorities are small, small, if not one at a time. And if you're really honest, when you have a priority and you hold it as a priority, you can get priorities done like this. You've got your timeline and now you move forward and you'll get a lot more done throughout the year and the things that truly were just to-do lists that weren't a priority, most of those end up flying away and the real important ones rise to the top and become a priority. Have a great week and be clear on what your priorities are. Talk to you next week. Bye-bye.